Okay, I'm in the side of Boca Cave, Oregon. I'm right near the entrance, which is kind of redundant. The whole cave is right by the entrance. It's not very long at all. It's just basically a sphere, like 100 feet in diameter. Really creepy. Um, trying to get the whole thing in one video, but my camera's being glitchy. So let me go ahead and go up this way a second. Notice the rock has a lot of texture. If you're feeling brave, you could climb up. I'm not feeling brave, but try to get a little bit closer, slightly better view. But yeah, look at this. If I climb over these rocks, it'll be like a 20 foot drop down. I'm not here to get a Darwin Award. There's the entrance, it's a sunny day. Look how bright it is, even this time of year. Notice the floor is wet. There's a little bit of water flowing. So here's the way up, one of the ways up. Notice it's sloped up at like a 35 degree angle. And uh, the rock on the right, it doesn't have anything growing on it. It's just got white dust on it. And then on the left, it's got a little bit of greenery from light hitting it, letting stuff grow just a bit. There's some stuff on the floor. It's probably just from people, other animals trampling it in. Here's a little side area with a mystery rock in it. Interesting overhang up there. I swear this looks like a, a lava tube, but it's not shaped like a tube. It's like it was lava and then it, the side just kind of broke away and fell right out, something. Really weird cave. Very, well, some kind of moth. A lot of moths in here, sleeping on the rocks. A little bit smooth here. Look at this. Still another 40 feet to the top. It's worn and smooth, like people have been climbing up there. I hope they know what they're doing. I know I'm not gonna try getting up there. 